guys and welcome back to my channel so for today's look I am going to be doing a black smoky eye tutorial and I've been wanting to do this for so long and I'm really excited for you guys to see it I really love how it turned out blending out black eyeshadow is a kind of a pain in the butt like when I originally filmed this it took me over six hours just to do the makeup and filming. Then my intro and outro files got corrupted. So here I am redoing my intro and outros. But I hope you guys enjoyed the makeup tutorial part. And let's go ahead and get into it. Alright, so we're just going to straight dive into it already have one eye done for this tutorial so I'm just going to show you guys how to do it on my other eye to achieve this smoky look for New Year's. Alright, so the two palettes that I'm using are from the Jaclyn Hill Vault collection and I'm going to be using Dark Magic and Armed and Gorgeous palettes from her Vault collection to create this. So I'm going to be taking the Dark Magic palette to lay down my first transition shade. I'm going to be using the shade Shh from the Dark Magic palette. I'm just going to be taking my Morphe 513 brush to do that. After you dip into the product, just tap off the excess and then start blending that into the crease. And I'm going to focus that more on the outer corner and then slowly drag it in to the inner corner and then do circular motions to blend that in. And before I go into any darker shadows, I'm just gonna go ahead and set some translucent powder under my eyes so that the black shadow does not stain underneath my eye. So I'm just gonna set that underneath real quick. And then I'm just going to use this so that it gives it a straighter edge afterwards. Alright, so now that I have the sh laid into my transition, I'm going to go ahead and jump into the Armed and Gorgeous palette. And I'm going to be taking Smooth Criminal right here. And I'm just going to use the same M513 brush. And then we're just going to set this in the crease as well, just right underneath that first transition shade. This is just going to add some warmth to the look. And then start doing circular motions just to kind of blend it all together. Alright, so once you have that laid down, I'm going to use my MAC 217 brush. And I am going to be dipping into... I'm going to be dipping into Prow, which is also in the Armed and Gorgeous palette. And just once again, that's going to go into the crease. I'm just going to make sure that you really want to tuck it in. And um, for this shade, keep it nice and low. I don't, you don't want to blend it up too high. And just kind of work it in there. And with this brush and shade, you're just going to do side sweeping motions. We're not going to do any circular motions. Okay, so we're just going to add one more shade into the crease before we add our black onto the eyelids. So I'm going to jump back into the Dark Magic palette. And I'm going to be using the shade Mojo. So this one, we're just going to keep it nice and tight. kind of see that everything's like starting to come together nicely just take your time blending out especially with like darker shades like black it's a really tough shade to blend out so just take your time and don't worry about rushing all right so to complete this look I'm gonna be taking my flat shader brush from bodyography pro so I'm going to take that and I'm going to go back into the Dark Magic palette. I'm going to be using the shade Temperous right here. And I'm just going to pack that on the eyelid. And 
and this shade has a little bit of shimmer to it um, and it's nice and it's really pretty I love it So once you've got that shade laid down, I'm going to be taking my Morphe E17 brush to kind of blend that in to the transition shades. Alright, so to do the bottom lash, I'm going to be taking this small doomed blending brush from Morphe and it's from the Jaclyn Hill collection. It's the JH39. So I'm just going to take that and I'm going to dip into that Mojo shade which is that nice dark chocolate brown and I'm going to run that along my lash line real quick. And then I'm going to take this then I'm going to take this blender brush from Too Faced and I'm going to jump back into the Arm and Gorge palette and I'm going to take that smooth criminal shade which was like that nice warm brown and stick it underneath just to blend it out the other shade and just kind of give it a more smoother transition so your lower lash lines should be nice and smoked out after that. I'm going to be taking my Maybelline Eye Studio in the shade Darkest Black. And this is a gel eyeliner. And I'm going to take that and tight line my waterline and everything like that. And I'm going to be using this flat liner brush. And this is also from Morphe. And it's from the Jaclyn Hill palette again. And it's the JH43. So I'm just going to take that and tight line my waterline real quick. Thank you guys so much for watching this makeup tutorial. I hope you guys really enjoyed it and if you guys have any requests for some other makeup tutorials that you guys want to see, please leave a comment down below and make sure to hit that subscribe button down below so that you guys can join the family. I do post new videos every Thursday at noon Pacific Standard Time so make sure that you join the family so that you never miss a video. I will be doing shout outs in my videos from now on so make sure that you are following me on Twitter because I will be posting a link to this video specifically so make sure you guys are following me on twitter and retweet this tweet so that you guys can get a shout out in my next video next week's video is going to be my 2018 favorite products of the year so i'm gonna go ahead and recap everything that i liked in 2018 so make sure you guys stay tuned for that and i'll see you guys next week have a good day